Smelly Belly Tea. My name is Jayla. My name is Ada. And today's Food Friday. We're in the Smelly Belly Kitchen as usual. Let's get started. We're a big fan of it. Peanuts Charlie, Charlie Brown. Yeah, Charlie Brown, sorry. But it's called The Peanuts Movie. The Peanuts Movie. It's coming out tonight. Go watch it. It is going to be in theaters, so. Can make the Charlie Brown cupcakes. Yeah, Can we're not going to watch it. We're just going to rinse like a different movie. So. Okay, so we have our peanut butter, one cup. We're going to put that in there. So one cup of peanut butter into the mixer. Delicious peanut butter. Yeah, peanut butter is a little tricky to work with, so if you use a spatula, you'll get all your product out. That looks so good. Mm -hmm. <laughs> it's gonna be yummy. Gonna so, peanut butter and jelly. Yeah, so we're gonna have our jelly in the middle for the filling, peanut butter frosting, and we also have a cute little topping, okay. which is the peanut cookie. It looks like a okay. peanut for peanuts. Ooh, I like the little nutter butter. Yeah, you, know, you can do the butter. We're doing one stick of butter or a half cup if you don't have sticks. Okay. Half cup of butter or one stick. Yep. Flop it all in. Feel so good. I can't get the rust out. Do you need my help? Yeah. There we go. I'm getting buttery today. All right. So put it down and turn it on. And you're just gonna um, lock it. Lock it. You're just gonna whip it until it's really creamy. Okay. And you're gonna scrape your sides as you go. And we'll give you guys a close up of what it's. You can speed it up just a touch. Like can I throw this away? There you go. I'm gonna go wash my hands. It sinks right there. So. Okay. Should I open this and make? All right. So open it up. Stop it. Um, and unlock it and scrape. Just make sure you have all your sides in. Ooh. And now we're gonna add the powdered sugar. Two cups. Oh, that's a big lump of butter. So we're just gonna put in two cups of powdered sugar. As you can see, it is liquidy. Um, the sugar is gonna make it more like frosting. So the peanut butter. And stuff. So again, two cups of powdered sugar. You wanna add a little at a time and start your mixer off slow because your powder will go flying. Yeah, because well, you know how like if you blow on flour, it goes poof into a big cloud. Yep. That's what this powdered sugar. Let's start off with that, and we'll see how that works. So turn it on like two. Wait. Oh, do oh, not. I'm scared. Here, I'll help you. <laughs> so get that going like that. And then it just turns into delicious. So once that's going for a minute, you can speed it up. Okay, add in another scoop. I think I can do this now. Okay. I think I can do this. It's hard. Okay, now shut it off. Yeah, lock it, babe. Don't want to get broken. Okay, shut it off, Ada. So now we're just gonna add one tablespoon of milk. This is what's gonna make it creamy. You wanna add a tablespoon at a time. It could be one or two. Yeah, add a little at a time. Ooh. You there don't go. wanna go overboard <laughs> with the milk. Oh, I can just smell add that. It it's going. It's fine. Just add it in. And then once it's creamy and not super thick, like now chunky. Okay, a little more milk. Oh, whoa. Oh no. Why didn't you Alright guys, so we just added it all and that was about three tablespoons. Wait. Okay. So we let it mix for like three minutes. So it got nice and fluffy. And we are not going to be showing you how we made the cupcakes and how we baked them because we do have a video on that. The link will be in the description. But we are going to show you how to get your frosting into the piping bag easier. Yeah, there's a little trick. You just take a cup, mm -hmm. put your piping bag like this, 
And then you can just scoop it all in and it'll be nice and neat for you. And you want to put a little bit over the edge so if some gets on the edge, it's fine. So just yeah, pop it in there and then scrape it on the potato. And we'll get one for each of you guys. Peanut butter's a little bit tricky. So yeah, that's all you gotta do. And it's a nice and easy trick that we do. Alright, so now we're gonna show you how to cut the hole in a cupcake for the jelly to go inside. So we're just gonna take it in. You don't wanna go all the way down, you just kinda of wanna guess and go in the middle. And you can turn your cupcake or just turn the knife. I personally think I personally think turning your knife cupcake is way easier on your knife. And then once it's done cut out. And we have our big jelly in our bag here. So you're just gonna fill your little hole up. Awesome. Good job. And then we're gonna fill it with the jelly. Which we have in a piping bag. Squeeze, squeeze, don't be afraid of it. I didn't make the whole, I can make the hole bigger if you need it. Do you need it bigger? Mama, do you need do you, yeah. need, do you need to use any specific like types of batter or does it matter? Cake batter? Yeah. Or what? Like flavor. Any flavor you want, but I would go with just plain because it's okay. peanut butter and jelly. Yeah. And then also if you don't have piping bags, you can just put it in a Ziploc bag and cut the corner of the Ziploc oh, bag yeah. and use it. There you go. We're just fancy. And we'll come up. You have to squeeze it. It's squeeze not just going to fly out. <laughs> there you go. Perfect. Okay? <laughs> That's all right. You can just take your knife and just, as you're doing it, if you push it, it, if you push down a little bit, it'll get in there much better. Yeah. There you go. Perfect. I want to squirt some of Touch this one up just a touch like this. Like get in there. Going. There you go, that's awesome. Now we're gonna do frosting. Mm. Basically what you do is you do your peanut butter over. That. Yes, so I'll cut your peanut can I, butter. Can I? Mm. Okay. This will be a pretty big hole, so. <laughs> that way you can cover it. And you want a lot of frosting so you can stick your little peanut in it. They, do, they would be cute just like this and then you add some more flavor into it. That's true, there you go. So as you're squeezing it, you're going to push down onto the cupcake, just like that. See that? Okay, perfect. Okay, see. Hey, there you go. <laughs> and you can just touch it up. This frosting is like more of a. You have enough. Goodbye. More of a thick frosting. Mine's funny. So you can just touch it up with your fingers and make it look, or a butter knife or something. Alright, so now we're just gonna add our little peanut cookie and our sprinkles, we're gonna be putting red sprinkles. Um, and also you make sure you wanna put enough, enough frosting for the nut butter to stick in. Just add your sprinkles. So this is our tribute to the Peanuts movie. Exactly. Charlie Brown. I think they came out awesome. You guys did a great job. You helped. Well, I helped, but you did really the all of it. Thank you guys for watching this food Friday. Comment down below what you want us to do next. And also on our Tin Cans Challenge video that we did yesterday, we want to get 100 likes on it, and then our mom and dad will do the Tin Can Challenge next week. So if we get 100 likes on the Tin Can Challenge video, not on this one, the Tin Can cha Challenge one, our mom and dad will be doing the can Tin Can Challenge, and it will be even more epic, and we'll have more gross foods, and I'm sure they'll try them. It'll be even more puking, and... Yeah, so I just wanted to subscribe, like, comment, share. Do all these great things you can do to support us. Bye guys, love you. <laughs> Click on the picture of me if you want to see more Food Fridays. <laughs> Click on the picture of me if you're feeling like a kill kid. Click on the picture of me if you're subscribe if you want more advice. Also guys, we'll check out our music video and Instagram and Snapchat. And I'll spend this under Smelly Belly TV. Oh.